Wind will continue to crank up into your early morning. High wind warning remains in place through midday for your Friday. That's gusts up to 60 miles per hour. So expecting that gusty wind around to start your Friday and holding on at least through the mid part of your Friday before they taper off into the afternoon. Now the risk of showers and thunderstorms, they stay in the forecast until about 5 or 6 o'clock in the morning. It looks like the window between midnight and that time period will be the worst to the weather as far as showers and storms go and any of these do have the capability of becoming stronger so we'll continue to monitor these through the night we are here and we'll keep an eye on them if anything gets out of hand of course we will alert you we'll go online streaming as well as uh, breaking in on air as warranted if needed with these storms but either way the risk of gusty wind moves in even if you don't get a thunderstorm in your location. So the rest of the overnight, showers and storms continuing to build in out of southwestern Ohio. That wind will start picking up, especially as we get into a 4, 5 o'clock in the morning. That's going to be the gusty uh, start of the worst of it, that, that is. As far as uh, temperatures go, they stay mild for us, but showers and storms uh, increasing 2, 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. And again, any of these can become stronger uh, until this cold front clears first thing tomorrow morning. The gusty wind, though, it's going to settle in for a few hours here to start your Friday. In fact, here you go at 7 o'clock up into the 40 mile per hour range of gusts, and we're not done there. It could gust up into the 50s, possibly as high as 60 miles per hour before this starts to settle down midday tomorrow and into the afternoon. Uh, so the rest of the overnight, temperatures dipping into the upper 50s, showers and thunderstorms likely becoming very windy. Now, staying windy to start your Friday, but tapering off into the afternoon. The risk of showers, mainly first thing in the morning. Uh, falling temperatures are expected throughout the day, and then getting into better weather tomorrow night, but dipping into the upper 30s. We'll be in the mid-60s on Saturday with partly sunny skies. Now, not a bad way to get our weekend going, but the chance of showers and storms return on Sunday. Uh, that comes with a cold front. In fact, you can expect cooling temperatures again uh, throughout the day. Uh, Monday, cooler but dry, upper 40s. Tuesday, we're back to the 60s. A small chance of some afternoon showers, but a big part of the day is dry. A better chance of some showers Tuesday night into Wednesday. And then after a warm up into the mid 60s, we're going to cool back down to the 30s next Thursday with a chance of rain or snow early.